Hello and welcome to Planned on Planning. Welcome to 2019. Welcome to this new year, this wonderful new time. But welcome back. And as you can see, we are in January and we need to make a January look good, look decent, and look on point. And to do that, we got to get it out of the blenders. So move that to the side and let's get some work done. So I have this beautiful washi to do. I'm sorry, we are in my gratitude planner. So I have my faith stickers that I'm gonna use the mini collection because they're a tad bit smaller and they work just a little better with everything that's going on. And then I have one sticker that I'm gonna use from my happy memory keeping. Truthfully, just one sticker <laughs> that I wanna use. But we got to lay this washi down first because we want to get some fun going on to start this year off right. That's right. We're going to be kicking our gratitude up a notch and hopefully being a blessing to more and more people this year. If I could just find the beginning of the washi, that clearly was not it. I have no idea what the beginning of the washi is. You know what I should do in the new year? Or now that the new year started? Start finding the beginning of the washi sooner. I'm just going to throw that out there. Maybe, just maybe, I should figure out the beginning of the washi a little bit sooner. Alrighty. So, here we go. Alright. And I'm just going to lay it down ever so gently. There we go. All right. And it almost cuts perfectly, to be very honest. Bam. Haha. Alright, and I'm trying once again to get like this perfect cut. It doesn't quite happen this time around, but I'm not gonna be too upset about it. It's all right. Okay. There we go. Let's get a little snip snip to do. Which is not an issue at all. If I don't dent up my table in the process. There we go. Just that easily. Bam. Alright, so there we are for starters. And I think it's a pretty good start. Let's get... This is the washi that I'm going to use to frame out my weeks. I thought it was really cute. The colors kind of match. I thought that, that worked. Let's do it. Ain't nothing to it but to do it. All right, so I'm gonna put it right at the top. There we go, right under the days of the week. And then we're going to go from there. Bam. How about that? I think it is really coming out very cutely. I mean, if I do say so myself. Tooting my own horn early in the year, because ain't nobody gonna toot, toot, toot it like you. All right. And then I'm just gonna do this bottom one. Oh, 
And I'm not going to go all the way across. I'm going to meet it just like I've met everything else. And then take it up the side. Ha ha. There we go. Bam. So there's the first page. And I like it. So let's do the second. And again, we're just going right under. Uh-huh. One more across. There we go. And then we're just going to take it right up the side one more time. Works out perfectly. Yes. I just love it when a plan comes together. All right, so let's get some stickers on and popping. Let's move that just to top it. Okay. So like I said, I have one sticker that I wanted to use for my memory keeping. And I have it marked off. And that's just some little glitz that I want to put up at the beginning. Um, because the first is on a Tuesday. So we have these two boxes available. And I just want to find something to nicely fit in it. I just want a little sparkle. That's all. Nothing too crazy. Honestly speaking. And then the rest are going to come from my Faith Mini collection. Like I said, the minis, they're just a tad bit smaller. So they just fit a little better um, when working in this planner and this planner style. So I just have... Oh. So I just have some stickers that I want to use. Bam. Now, I use this planner for my gratitude planner. So as a monthly view, I write daily, like something that I'm thankful for, some way, some way that I was blessed, the way that I was blessing to others. And then in the weekly, I go a little bit more in depth as to what those blessings are or were for that day. So that's why I don't really like putting much inside the boxes because I'm really writing there and getting some things down. Um, I did want to put a little prayer list over here. I thought that'd be nice to do. And then I'm just taking a little... What's going on? Some other ones that I can use. Here we go. Oh, no, not these. Here we go. Just trying to follow the color scheme that we have going on. You know, something nice and bright. Okay. 
See, faith in God, faith in God includes faith in his timing. So I think that's nice to get right here in the corner. Ha ha. How about that? I know I keep it super simple when it comes to this planner. Oh, there were some, where did I see them at? Oh, here we go. We have some, see, even though we have, oh, this one doesn't really match. Okay. I just realized there's another prey that works a little bit more with the colors that we're trying to go. So I thought this was really cute to have, let's do it down here for this planner. If I could not make it crooked, it would really work. There we go. There we go. Oops. And I think I want to add a rejoice as well. Um, let's do that up here because it's the first. Bam. Let's just move it over a little bit. Darn it. I cut my nails and every day I'm realizing that may have been a really bad idea. There we go. There's a choice. And down here I'm going to have a prayer list of everything. You know, whether it's something that I want to pray for or something that somebody else is requesting that I pray for. That's going to be there. Haha. <laughs> and I'm just looking for, yeah, just another. There we go. A little something. Damn. All right. So I know it's pretty plain Jane and pretty ordinary, but it actually works wonders for me. Because, like I said, in each of the days, I like to write something down that either I felt blessed by or, you know, or I was able to be a blessing to someone else. So it's like a little mini reflection. So I do need the space that's there. So that's why I keep it really plain and simple when it comes to um, the monthly view of my gratitude planner. I do thank you ever so much for joining me. If you have any questions, concerns, or even any prayer requests, feel free to comment below. If you feel more comfortable emailing me, um, you know, any questions or prayer requests or things of that nature, you can email me at plansonplanning at gmail.com. Do not forget to follow me on social media. Once you click the follow button, click the send message and then let me know you saw the video. Um, if you had any questions about the washi with the stickers, pens that I use, how I actually operate in this planner, any of those questions or you just want to talk about something, like let's, let's chat it up, it's whatever, um, definitely don't forget to message me on that. But in the meantime, in between time, later days.